Hi, this is Jeff Challen. In this screencast, I'm going to show you how to use the MP1 auto grader. And this is pretty much the same process that you'll use to grade other assignments in this class. Our goal with providing you an auto grader is to try to make sure that you have a very accurate idea of what your grade is on the assignment. Uh, we can do this on your own machine because the process that we're going to use to grade your uh, submission is identical uh, to the one that you're going to run locally. So when we receive your submission, we're going to copy some files over to make sure that you haven't changed our test suite. And then we're going to run this exactly same uh, program on the remote server and use that to calculate your final score for the assignment. So let's show you how to do this. So once you have a copy of MP1, uh, if you go over here into the run configuration menu, you'll find under the Gradle project, category is something called grade mp1 and when I run this you'll see it's going to think for a moment it's going to compile things run my test suites and then it provides a grade breakdown here at the bottom so I've earned 40 points on this assignment out of a total of 100 I have 10 points for uh, no check style problems and then 10 points each for factorial quiz master and winner um, because those programs compiled, but they did not um, actually successfully pass the tests, and so I didn't get more points. If you break the build, so let me show you what happens now. So I'll just put a little bit of silliness into my factorial class and rerun the auto grader. You can run the auto grader as many times as you want. Uh, it's free. You'll see here that there were compilation problems. And sometimes uh, those can also cause check style to not run. So in this case, Chuckstyle was not able to run because my project didn't compile, and you'll also see that factorial test didn't compile. If I add another compilation error into Quizmaster, I'm going to receive even fewer points. So again, run as grade MP1. Now I've only got 10 points. So it's really important that you turn in code that compiles. That's um, going to earn you, you know, 30 points on the assignment. And as long as it compiles, you have a chance of getting the check style points, the 10 check style points as well, um, even if you don't pass all the test cases. So this is just a quick overview of how the auto grader works. Um, again, feel free to run this as many times as you want locally. Um, and this should give you an idea of exactly where you stand on assignment MP1.